Hey guys, welcome back to another Championship Predictions video. We are at the Week 8 stage, but looking back at Week 7, top scorer for that game week was Doug. Douglas James Horn from the Dugout Football Channel. Doug came away with 20.5 points and three perfect scores overall. How that affects the overall leaderboard now? We've got two people on 63 points. That's Mark Chapman and Maka03. And just half a point behind is Harvey Marsh. But let's see if we can all catch up with those guys by making predictions for week eight. So first up on Friday, we've got West Brom coming up against Burnley. Burnley finding their feet in the championship. Now back-to-back -back wins, a good win against Millwall last time out. And West Brom, draw specialists, you could say, along with Preston in the division. Last time out, they drew one more with Wigan. So I'm going to edge this one to Burnley. I'm going to go for two, a one scoreline. Then we've got Blackburn Rovers coming up against Bristol City. Blackburn Rovers returning to winning ways after a free uh, match losing streak, being Blackpool 1-0, of course. And Bristol City, three wins now out of their last four games, beating Huddersfield in uh, their last fixture. I fancy goals in this one, and I'm going to go for Desmond's 2-2. Two -two. Then we've got Huddersfield coming up against Blackpool. This one's got draw written all over it. Uh, both teams finding it hard to find any consistency, so I'm going to go for a 1-1 one, one draw. Then we've got Hull coming up against Sheffield United. Blades currently at the top of the league on 14 points. Hull City, good start to the campaign, but they've lost two out of their last three now. Uh, a defeat at home against Queen's Park Rangers wasn't too clever. So I'm going to go for the Blades in this one, and I'm going to go for a 2-1 away victory. Then we've got Luton coming up against Wigan Athletic. Uh, Luton, a very good away victory against Cardiff City to inflict their first defeat at home for this season. And Wigan gaining that 1-1 draw against uh, West Brom. But I fancy Luton to carry on their good form, and I'm going to go for 2-0 home victory. Then we've got Millwall coming up against Cardiff City. Uh, Millwall totally out of form at the moment. Losing free on the bounce, and Cardiff haven't won in four. So fancy drawing this one at the, the new den. I'm going to go for a 1 1 scoreline. They've got Norwich coming up against Coventry. Norwich now four wins on the bounce. Last time out, good um, victory, you could say, against Birmingham and Coventry. Back in their home ground, a loss against Preston, and we know how hard Preston find it. Uh, to score, but they lost 1 0. So I'm going to go for a straightforward 2 0 victory to the Canaries. Then we've got Preston coming up against Birmingham City. Uh, Preston winning, winning for a change, and Birmingham losing, not for a change. Uh, 1 0 victory to Preston in this one. Then we've got Rotherham coming up against Watford. Rotherham have been doing really well since they've been back in the Championship. However, last time out they suffered defeat against Sunderland, their counterparts in promotion last season. And Watford, one defeat in seven, a good 2-1 victory over Middlesbrough in the last game round. So I fancy Watford just to nick this one, be a tight game, 2-1. We've got Swansea coming up against QPR. Swansea against Stoke, that first half, they could have conceded from a number of set pieces, but they they, uh, they they drew that game in the end 1-1 when Stoke uh, equalised right at the death. QPR, back-to-back -back wins now, uh, beating Hull last time out. So I fancy QPR to go to the Swansea.com stadium and grind out a 2-1 victory, another tight match. And have got Reading coming up against Stoke. Now Reading, not sure what you can get with them. You know they've got a bit of a Fred Bear squad there. Stoke City, manager and all that. I fancy... A draw in this one. There we go. 1-1. One, one. They've got Middlesbrough at home against Sunderland on Monday evening. Another tight one. A good clash up in the northeast. But I fancy Middlesbrough just to win this one. 2-1, but it will be a cracking game. So those are my predictions for week eight of this championship season. Make sure you leave your predictions over at the Super Brew website and in the comments section. Enjoy your championship weekend. Enjoy the football across the whole of the, uh, the three days as well. But in the meantime, take care and I'll see you all in the next video.